Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Today we'll go back to Al Halmiya and Cairo to remember the good old days and how did we used to celebrate at the birthday of the Prophet. The preparation for the celebration will start maybe weeks before the actual birthday of the Prophet. Lighting, decoration, and the parade going out in the middle of the road, chanting and singing to praise the Prophet. People who used to wear different colorful clothes with different flags, with different drums and musical instruments. And it was so beautiful, so attractive, so powerful, and so emotional. A lot of children used to follow them. People from the balconies and the windows used to come and clap for them and uh, come very happy with that. We used to have also what we call it uh, birthday sweets, which we used to go to buy a box filled of sesame seed candies, peanut candies, uh, Turkish delight, uh, coconut candies, and others and the others and the others. But for the young children like me and the others, the shops used to make what we call it the sweet horse and the sweet pride. What does it mean? Out of the sweetening material, they build this horse and they build this pride and they sell it to the children. And when the celebration is over, we used to break the horse and the bride and eat it because it is very, very delicious to eat that. This kind of celebration brings us back to the reality of the community and the life of the people in the area, very close, together, and using the very simple uh, initiative to make everybody happy. Everything was homemade, or everything was made by very simple manual work.